What's going on, everybody? How are you doing? My name is Dr. Sami Bayer. Please welcome back to my channel. The covert narcissist. What are the quick ways of spotting a covert narcissist? I'll give you five ways. Number one, false humility. You see, narcissists will pretend to have humility. But this is uh, pride. It's a form of pride which is hidden. The narcissist, the covert narcissist, will always play the victim. They will always want to put themselves down. They will always want to, to do everything to make sure that you compliment them. They want you to praise them. They want you to validate them. Then covert narcissists will say that they're doing things because they want to. They'll say they are volunteering to do certain things. But the main aim of the covert narcissist is to get approval, is to seek approval, is to be praised, is to get attention. The covert narcissist is not humble, as you think. He's not truly humble. They are self-centered individuals. They're just concerned about themselves. And what they want is to be people to clap for them. To praise them. To be seen as very important. To seek high status positions. That is what the narcissist wants. They want to be on the spotlight. But they hide that fact. They pretend they disguise that in humility. But we know that the main goal of the narcissist is for you to recognize them, to acknowledge them, to praise them, to clap for them, all right, to get that attention that they need badly from you. The number two sign of a covert narcissist is just like just like any other narcissist, the covert narcissist lacks empathy. You will have many issues, many concerns, which are very valid. But the surprising thing is that the narcissist will ignore all this. The narcissist will follow their selfish uh, agenda, their selfish uh, needs. Because the narcissist is a very selfish person. They want to be isolated. That way, they know they can stick to their own selfish needs. They will ignore you when you are sick. But when they are not, when they are sick, they want you to take care of them. They want you to be concerned about them. For the narcissist, it is them first. They want your life to revolve around them. They believe their needs are more important than others' needs. The narcissist wants to be served. They don't want to serve. The narcissist believes they are more important than you. They are special than you, than anyone else. So their needs are more important than everyone else's. Number three sign of a covert narcissist is that they have these immature responses. We all know that narcissists are extremely sensitive and they hate criticism with all their heart and mind and body when you criticize the narcissist they will take offense even simple criticisms they will swing into narcissistic rage just a small criticism they'll magnify it They'll magnify the offense. The narcissist doesn't know how to, con to converse, to dialogue. They'll always want to deflect the blame or to, re to project the blame onto someone else, onto you, for instance. They'll do something wrong and they'll blame you for it. Or they'll blame someone else for it. The narcissist 
when they are extremely angry, they will also try to pretend that they are okay, that they are not bothered. But their nonverbal body language shows rage. They'll say they are good, they are okay, they are calm, but they are not. Now, the number four sign of a covert narcissist is they belittle other people's needs. They minimize the needs of other people that they interact with. They don't want to go to the details of any situation because it is wasting their time. They, they love projecting blames onto others or reflecting blames onto others instead of even taking responsibility for their own actions. That is what the narcissists love doing best. They don't want to be stressed out with facts, with logic. They want it is their way or the highway. For the narcissists, they are always right. All right. And their needs comes first. And finally, the number five sign of a covert narcissist is that it is all about them. They want to be listened to. And they cannot listen to others. The narcissist wants to be the one talking. They want to be on the center stage. They are very quick at giving advice. When they realize they have very minimal um, contribution in a dialogue, then they shut down. They don't want to put a lot of energy in relationships. The narcissist doesn't care about you. They don't care about others, people's needs. They don't care about what you have to say. They focus on what is best for them. It doesn't matter what you're sharing. It is about them. If they don't, if they don't feel that they are on the center of it, then they shut down. They just stop listening. They want to be the ones listened to. That is what the narcissist wants. All right now, there you have it. Those are the five signs of a covert narcissist. Please, if you are watching this video and you've not subscribed to my YouTube channel, spare a second or two and smash that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell as well. That way, every time I upload a new video, you'll get notified about it. Thank you. Knowledge is power. Information is power. And learning is a superpower. I love you all to the moon and back. God bless you. Catch you later in the next video.